November 26th was the date. The Pontiac Silverdome, the site for the 14th MHSAA State Football Championships. Next up, the Class A State Championship game between the Shamrocks of Detroit Catholic Central and the Traverse City Trojans. Traverse City took the opening kickoff 80 yards for a touchdown, paced by the running of fullback Mike Nedlicki. Trailing by seven in the second quarter, Detroit CC Scott Hauncher goes to the big tight end Jaeger. It's 15 yards and a first down. Then late in the second quarter, Josh Werfel of Traverse City lines up for what looks like a 46-yard field goal attempt. It's long enough, and it's good. A new state championship record, 46 yards for Josh Werfel. Detroit CC still trails by 10 in the third quarter when Dave Owens takes a handoff, breaks a couple of tackles, and zips up the middle into the end zone, 23 yards for the touchdown. The Shamrocks are back in it, trailing only by three. But Traverse City puts together another drive in the fourth quarter, paced by Mike Nedlicki. They get the ball down to the three, then the handoff goes to Brad Warren. He goes off the right side into the end zone for the touchdown, and Traverse City now leads 17-7. CC tries to come back in the fourth quarter, but this pass over the middle is intercepted by Andy Bailey, who makes a nice return. Traverse City is knocking on the door once again. Late in the game, Detroit Catholic Central's Hauncher looks for Jaeger again in the corner of the end zone, and he makes the catch for the touchdown, but it's not enough. Traverse City's Jim Uli starts to celebrate on the sideline. He's got himself another state championship, and he wants his players to know just how he feels about them. Detroit CC's Tom Mock receives the runner-up trophy. And Traverse City receives the championship trophy in Class A. They deserve it, and so do the thousands of fans who made the long journey down from Traverse City. That concluded the first session with two more championships still to come.